I'm here with Mike Walsh, who is the president and CEO of U.S. Legal Markets for LexisNexis. And we just finished a panel on the future of the legal industry. We had law firms, clients, law schools on that. And one of the big questions I thought that you answered really well was, what's the big opportunity for law firms in this new environment? Well, law firms are clearly going through a period of unprecedented change. Uh, this is the first year where we've seen major contraction among major law firm revenues in quite some time. Mm -hmm. I think over the next uh, three, five, and ten years, law firms have a major opportunity to set themselves apart and distinguish themselves mm -hmm. by becoming more customer-centric, by focusing on building better relationships with corporate counsel figuring out how to deliver needs on their terms better. Mm -hmm. Ones who do that, I think, are going to set themselves apart. I think those are going to be the winners uh, in the long run. I think ones who don't do that uh, are going to face some choppy times. You know, an interesting thing, when I go around and visit lots of law firms around the country, the mid-sized firms, from about 150 to 300 lawyers, secretly tell me we're having the best year we ever had. Yep. Any, is that because they're doing those kinds of practices? I, yeah, I think, I think you know, mid-sized firms can be more nimble right now. It's easier to turn on a dime faster if you're smaller. Sometimes uh, bigger firms have a harder time adjusting to tough times. So sure. that it, it's not surprising to hear that. I hear that when I, when I talk to mid-sized firms. It doesn't mean big firms can't do this. There, there are some big firms that have adopted their model, uh, innovated at the core, and can better serve their clients. Mm -hmm and they can leverage global skill. A big, huge trend is, is, is globalization. Sure. Uh, but still, I think mid-size have a great opportunity. You know, one of the things that the uh, corporate counsel and law firms both talked about is a need for more transparency and open trust. I mean, uh, technology helps with that, other things help with that? I think transparency and trust are, are, are the critical factors. That's how the firms can distinguish themselves. I think they've got to be the leaders in reaching out and, and building that trust, but it's got to happen on both sides. Technology is key. Uh, increasingly, there are uh, technologies that help law firms and corporate counsel collaborate uh, mm -hmm. well together. I think the more that firms and corporate counsel adopt it, the better off they'll both be in, a, in uh, arriving at, at a point um, that they're both happy with over time. Absolutely. Well, hey, Mike, thanks a lot for being on the panel. It was fantastic. I really enjoyed it. Thank you. Thanks. All right, Daryl.